guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video so today is June 9th and it is time to celebrate another birthday of June so today's birthday is Charlotte's it's Charlotte's very first birthday we're gonna decorate a little bit I'm gonna say a little bit because I didn't really buy a lot but I bought two little things it's basically for photos and then we have presents that I bought so she'll get that and also Charlie will get his birthday present and I have Charlotte dressed up in the cutest this little birthday outfit ever. Hold on, let me turn this around so you guys can see it. How cute does she look? She loves to rub against the walls. That is something that she has done for like so long. I don't know what it is. But she has this really cute dress on. And funny story, I actually bought that from Build-A-Bear. Yes, Charlotte is small enough she could fit in Build-A-Bear workshop clothes. So I bought that for her and I think it's really cute. So that's what she's gonna wear. Also bought these two decorations. Basically, we're just making a little photo props stand or photo stand so this is a balloon kit and you just blow it up and then this really cute garland I think it's gonna look really cute behind the banner also bought this jumbo bandana it's my birthday so I got this from PetSmart I mean look how big it is guys so I got it from PetSmart and it said it was a small and the reason I got went with that is because it was the smallest size that they even sell in bandanas like from Petco or PetSmart they have extra small no extra, nowhere extra, 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 extra small. so look at how big it is so I think we're just gonna lay it on the ground and we'll get pictures but it's not like all out as Charlie's second birthday but I don't really think she'll mind it I think this is gonna look cute so we're gonna decorate real quick I'll show you guys the setup get some pictures pictures because it's three o'clock in the afternoon I have not posted anything on anyone's social media yet so we have to do that like ASAP okay so mom figured out how to blow these balloons up so here is the final touches which actually these balloons I think are gonna work better Charlotte hates balloons that are actually on the ground so these will work better this is a cute setup we can get some cute pictures and we need to put the bow in her hair so do you think I put it low enough on the wall I, was just I know that's what I'm thinking like we'll have to just set up and it's see so little. okay so it is time for Charlotte for some birthday tree I should say so here is her frosty paw and we're getting ready to give it to her So apparently Charlotte likes the Frosty Paw. So it was a win-win for sure. And Charlie's having to sit and watch this time because last birthday, he wouldn't give Charlotte any of his. My hair is literally such a mess right now. But I wanted to add on to this video because I did not really film much yesterday. So I was like, you know what? I promised you guys a Q&A, like part two to the q and I already did. So that's what I'm gonna add into this video because so many people have been wanting to ask me more questions and here we go, I'm gonna do a part two. So I'm just gonna go through and answer some of the questions that you guys sent in for me because there was quite a few. So let me just get to the questions and then we'll start asking. Okay, so the first question is from A. Ray. 904. I'm not sure what the name is, but they asked, what is your favorite thing to do in the summer? Favorite thing of all time is hang out with friends and also swim. I've always been like a person that loves going swimming, so those are definitely my favorite things to do during the summer. Soccer fan for life asked, least favorite movie you've ever watched? Oh my gosh. This is a really tough question because there's not really many movies that I don't like. I don't know if I have a least favorite. I really don't. I know I've watched some movies that, in my opinion, were really stupid. But honestly, I can't remember what their name was just because we watched them just to laugh. So I can't remember what the actual name of the movies were. But I'm sure if I had a full on list of all the movies I've seen, I probably could pick out one. But right now, I'm actually not sure what my least favorite movie is. Next question is by Autumn. And they asked, do you have a boyfriend? I had so many people ask me this. And no, I do not have a boyfriend. Sharon asked, what is your favorite hobby? Favorite hobby at the moment is probably like photography. Even though that technically is my job also. It's always been a hobby of mine, so I'm just gonna say it's a hobby. Next question is from Kate, and they asked, will you ever live at the beach? I would love to live at the beach, just because something about just being by the ocean makes me so happy. I'm obsessed with the beach. It's one of my favorite places to go. So I think it would be a lot of fun to live at the beach. Now, if it will ever happen, I'm not sure because who knows what's gonna happen in the future. But if I ever got the opportunity to move to the beach, I definitely would take it. Next question is from Charlie. 
Charlie and they asked, will I visit Tennessee soon? I would love to visit Tennessee. I've always been obsessed with it, like pictures I should say, because I've never been to Tennessee. I would love to visit Tennessee. Like absolutely would love to see Nashville and Knoxville and all those fun places. So I'm really hoping we, we do visit soon. I think it'd be so fun to like go there in fall because I just think the mountains would be beautiful there. Next question is from Jessica and I actually got this a few times and they asked, how do you deal with stress and hate? Honestly, with hate, I'm one that I just usually laugh it off. Like, most of the time, if someone sends a hateful comment, <laughs> laugh about it because it's pretty funny. Usually during stressful situations though, I'm usually pretty calm about it. I'm not really usually one to get really stressed out. Now hey, yes, it's sometimes hurtful, but most of the time I've just learned that, you know what, the only reason they hate on you is because one, they're just jealous. JC and they ask, when you were little, what was your favorite item? My favorite item probably when I was little was like, my Teletubby doll. Okay, so this next question is from Larissa and she asked so many questions, so thank you so much. I love when I get a lot of questions. I'm gonna just go through her list real quick and answer some of her questions. So the first one was, do you want to move out? Currently, not right now. I'm sure in the future I want to move out, eventually get my own space, but right now I'm a-okay with where I'm at. Next is, do you wish you had your own room? Yes and no. I enjoy sharing a room with my sister, I really do, because we've just shared a room for quite some time now, but I do think also I would really enjoy having my own room just because mine and Briley's personalities are completely different. Next question is when do you want kids? Whenever I'm married. <laughs> I don't really want kids now obviously but whenever I get married yes I would want kids then. Next have you gotten your driver's license? <laughs> yes I've had my driver's license for quite some time. What age was your first kiss? Oh my gosh let me think how old was I? 17, 18? 17, 18 I must say. Can't really remember what age but I'm thinking like 17 or 18. Next, what's it like having a big age gap between you and your brother and sister? It's not bad. I think it's pretty cool because we're all going through like different life stages. We're not all the same age. I think it's pretty cool. What made you start YouTube? So for the longest time, I've always been one to love a camera. Like I have so many home videos of me stealing my mom's camcorder and like going to my room with my friends and pretending we had a YouTube channel. So when I was younger, I've always been one to be on the stage or be in front of a camera. I just loved it. So when I got uh, older my sister started getting more into social media and I was like you know what I really wanted to do this also so I ended up starting me a YouTube channel and I love it I would not change anything I love YouTube it's so much fun getting to connect to you guys in the beginning it was super weird because I'm like oh my gosh I'm talking to a camera and there's no one there but I don't know it's just how, like having a bunch of virtual friends I just think it's a lot of fun so YouTube's definitely one of my favorite things that I'm doing with my life right now next is would you consider doing a makeup course I don't know if you mean like me teaching a makeup course or me actually taking one. Either would be really cool. What do you like about photography? So I love photography just because you get to meet so many people and you get to capture someone's special moments in life. Next question is from Carly and they asked, do I like ASMR? Yes. I So I went through a spell on my channel where I posted a lot of ASMR videos. I actually have a playlist titled ASMR if you guys would like to check those out. But I went through ASMR. It was a lot of fun to film. Part of me was like it's more time consuming to film an ASMR video because you had to put up a mic and get everything like super quiet in your household because any little noise picked up on that Yeti mic. I might film another ASMR video soon if you guys would like to see that. Let me know down below. Next question is from Travis and they asked what are your plans for a good career? So currently right now I YouTube as you guys know and also I'm a photographer. If you guys didn't know that I'm a photographer. That's kind of what my plan in life was. That's why I didn't really go to college as soon as I got out of school. I took a few years off just to really focus on my photography career. So now that I'm getting older, I'm studying business. So eventually, if photography isn't as successful as I would like it to be, I'll do photography on the side and then Monday through Friday get me like a normal business job. Next question is from Kayla and they asked, would you let your dad cut your hair? No. Next question is from Allison and they asked, what's your favorite song, old or new? So one of my favorite songs right now would be Intentions by Justin Bieber. I just still love that song. That and also like The City. I love that song. But guys, that's all the questions I'm going to answer for this Q&A video. I believe I pretty much hit all the main questions that you guys asked. If there's any more that I missed or you thought of a question that you'd like for me to answer, leave those down below on this video or send them to me to my Instagram DMs. I will definitely answer those. So we'll have like a part three to this. So let me know if you guys want to see another Q&A video. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to comment down below and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video.